Well, welcome once again to I'm the Good Thing, the podcast. Now, this is the place where we unpack life wisdom. We pray, we affirm, and most of all, we discover our true beauty, our worth, and our power. I'm Denise Taylor, and I'm all about helping women build a life they love. And that begins with us believing everything good about who God created us to be. Now, I help women break through everything standing in their way, get what they secretly want, and prioritize themselves, their success, and their happiness. I want you to know you can be your own priority. Now, this is the place where we get energized in a God kind of way as we see ourselves the way God sees us. And let me tell you, sis, you are good. Now, today's life wisdom is this. You didn't give up even though you wanted to. You should feel proud of yourself. Now, I don't know about you, but I have this tendency to be really hard on myself, especially when I'm down. It seems like I can figure out everything that's wrong about me and kick myself the hardest when I am at a low. When in fact, what I need in that moment is more of a picker upper. I need to be able to activate the same thing that I do for others for myself. See, you're probably like me that when you encounter a friend that is feeling rather low about something they're dealing with, you have all the words of encouragement to inspire them to keep going. You can call out all of the great things about them that make them so good at what they do. And you even can help them dream about getting past the hurdle they're facing now. We are really good friends to others, but we're often hard on ourselves. And when we are down and when we are facing difficult moments, it's the exact time that we should be taking that superpower of being an encouraging friend and lighting it up for ourselves. And so my challenge to you is this, the next time you're feeling low, The next time you want to give up because you hit some kind of snag, the next time the result didn't turn out like you thought, or you didn't get the support you were thinking you should, instead of beating yourself up, you should begin to feel proud of yourself. You should begin to cheer yourself on. You should begin to encourage yourself. You should begin to believe in yourself even more. And you should be proud of what you've accomplished so far. You should encourage yourself the very way you would encourage a friend. Thanks for connecting with me today. If this was a help to you, apply what stood out most to your life. Now, if you're ready to make yourself a priority, get what you secretly want and experience success on your own terms, I invite you to book a call with me. You can access my calendar at www.callwithdenise.live to see how I can help. Now be sure to subscribe so you can meet me here next time and share this with someone else. Keep seeing yourself the way God sees you. After all, you are the good thing. And check out I'm the good thing.com for all sorts of good stuff. And I'll see you next time.